Okay, hi. In this tutorial I want to show you how to create the simplest plan possible. So let's start in the plan designer, create some folder to put our stuff in. Simple plan, create a new plan. Okay, here we have it. State. We have only one state, so let's call it like this. Default task is OK. So what should the robot do in here? Uh, let's create a new behavior. Drive circle. OK, and we have it here. Drive circle. We need the configuration in here. That's fine. You can switch it to um, master plan. So. Okay, now generate the code. Okay. Let's see what we have in Eclipse now. We auto generate it into this L expression. Auto generate it. Press F5 here for updating. Plans. Behaviors. No. Simple plan there. Here is the behavior. It's auto generated and we have the protected regions here. Uh, everything you code should be inside of a protected region, otherwise the plan designer will override it when you auto-generate this code again. So please code inside of protected regions. All we want to do is let the uh, robot drive in a circle, therefore we need a motion control, with which is inside the namespace msl to HR messages motion control MC and MC has motion angle what else mm, pi and MC motion rotation oh it's this drive forward with a translation 1000 millimeters per second in the direction 0 degree and rotate 90 degrees per second which is quite fast, let's do it like this at the end we have to send this motion control message to the corresponding driver. So that's all. In the plan we don't have to do anything. We can use the default utility function and nothing has to be done here because it's a quite simple plan. Okay, let's see whether this is compiling. Yeah, I guess I already made the first mistake here because the MSL expression repository won't recognize my no new files I think normally you have to touch the um, CMake lists txt file to make it uh, recognize new files Meanwhile, we can start some software to test. Um, how do we do it? Let's say robot nas. So we set our environment variable robot to the name of our robot, which is nas, and run our process manager with minus simulator. It will start a ROS core by itself. It 
this and reports. Next thing we want to use is our robot control. Here it comes. All robots and all configuration files. We only need NASA, so we remove every other oops, robot. Savvy. Okay, and then we can make it smaller. Choose simulator and start. Okay, let's wait. Compile. It still compiles. Let's see. Probably I did not build since the last pull from the repository, though there are several new files compiling at this time. Mm -hmm. But what we can start, I think, is visualization. Here it is. cannot do is start our base. Our plan we just created with this because this is only for uh, the plan VM16. WM16 I mean. So we need to start the base by hand. This would look like um, robot NASA ROS run MSL base Minus master plan simple plan. Okay, one package failed. Here you see, he did not recognize this reference here. So this is because uh, I need to touch the the file I told you. Uh, Ross CD MSL expressions touch CMake lists. That can build uh, MSL expressions. No depths. Okay. Let's see whether this is starting. Can I find executable name? No. Probably he did not build the base because MSL expressions wasn't finished, and with the last command I only uh, compiled MSL expression. So now he's compiling the base. Okay. Again, yes. So base is running. Do we have now the simulator, which is actually a ROS launch file, which is launching Gazebo. Yeah, and our gazebo control and we want to use NASA so let's see here it is and we also see it here and yeah that's it actual question is why he does not drive in a circle let's see Oh, let's, let's just debug this. Actually, our behavior should send this motion control. And so let's check whether we get something on the motion control. Yes, here you see NASA ID 9 is sending one meter and the rotation. Ah, I know, I know, I know. We didn't start our base with the minus sim flag for simulator. And now you should see it is driving in circle. Here you see it in the simulator. And 
on our base station. So, that's it.